this is how I'm gonna die, guys. Sick. Oh god, god. I thought he was fucking over. Oh god. Why aren't you tracking me? Hey guys, welcome back to an episode of Full Stack Server. Uh, today, we are out at my new place, so let me go back to the sign. Okay, so, I found this a while ago, and, um, I didn't say anything. I said, I, I told Hope I'm moving out past the Mesa Biome, which I am. We're not gonna go through that portal, because I really don't... Some people will probably know how to get here. I'm not ready, obviously, to show anybody where I live. Okay, so here's the sign. If you found this spot, why are you out here? Really? It's a pop for a huge blue mansion. Um... So let's go ahead, I'm going to show you guys round, like, kind of show you what my layout, my idea there is right now. I actually thought and some of this out for this mansion. So here's where the mansion is going to be. We have to fill in some of this water so that, um, it will fit. This will actually, I think the mansion is going to be one of the last things we work on just because I have a lot of space that way to go with it. The, one of the first things, which I'm not going to do this episode, but it's the first thing I want to do. So we're going to do it first, is we're going to work on this boathouse. I'm figuring about this big. Um, maybe a little wider. We're gonna terraform some, try to make it so this water, I might move that beacon. That is actually the recovery zone, you guys will see in a minute. The beacon, we can move over here. I'm gonna tear a lot of this down, make it lower leveled, um, so it looks more like a river than a stream, because I don't like how shallow it gets. Like, over in here, where it's only one water deep. One water deep. Like, I don't like this. I, I want it to feel rivery. Um, let's see if we can get up there before it goes away. Mm. There we go. Okay. Ah. Uh. So the boathouse will be there. Look, we haven't we haven't finished them all yet. Uh, the tennis courts will be in here, down here. I want to say this is, yeah, the garage, and it bends. It does an L. This is as far as I got. I want to build those before I I continue. Um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, for like clue, this is uh, these are in clue. Um, there's electronic clue. Which was one of my favorite versions, Clue, and is still one of my favorites other than the main thing. Here's what I'll, I have a horse stable, front gate, the pool, and the middle garden to do with the road that goes around the, the mansion. So the main mansion's here. The front gate is actually... I want to say it's right over in here. So there's going to be a lot of terraforming. There's going to be a lot of changing the land, fixing everything up so it all gets, it's all going to fit. Uh, it doesn't even completely flat, but I don't need like the front gate way up here and everything else way down there. That is going to look weird. But on... To the main part of the episode. Uh, we're going to be working on stuff down here. So this is where I, I've been living. And my chameleon head, and a grox head, and a cali head, and a piggy head, and then on the wall. And I have these chests. Um, a lot of stuff, random stuff in it. Random stuff, right? Okay, so th this is not, it's not going to work. So, what I'm doing is going way down these stairs. I'm going to turn these into real stairs. I'm going to decorate this, because actually going to be a key part of my base, the non-looks part of my base, how about that? It's still going to have looks, it's still going to be pretty. <laughs> See, there's the beacon. Uh, the beacon right now, it's for haste. I cleared this all out. I need to, I think, go one up, more up on the ceiling. So this is going to be my mining area and my storage. Um, as you can see, I've moved some stuff. Like This whole column is just going to be for smooth stone. I collect a lot of it over time. There's going to be random blocks. I'm going to go through, I'm going to label every single chest. Or maybe just like label one and arrows up and down. I'm not quite sure how I'm gonna do it yet for the ones that take up a lot. I really like the sea lanterns back there. I think they look kind of cool because you don't see the white. I'm not. I don't like the white part of sea lanterns all that much, but I like the green part. But sea lanterns were they looked to me a bit nicer than glowstone from the ground. So. This is going to be a mining area, it will be, like, mined out, obviously. Down here, dig stuff up. Moving on. Uh, how these are staggered, you shouldn't see these on the lower part. Except these ones, because I forgot to stagger them. And I already dug it all out, and I don't... I might have to go through and fix that, just because I want it staggered. Yeah, I'm probably gonna do that off camera. I I noticed it, was trying to ignore it. Yeah, I'm not gonna like it anymore. It needs to be staggered. I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna stagger them. So you can't see any of that. 
And here's the big question. What do I do for the floor? Uh, what goes good with bedrock? Uh, look at the bedrock. It's got these tiny purple spots. See? Right in there. I'm not sure if this is my, my resource back or not. Tiny purple spots, okay? Tiny purple spots. I thought about putting purple clay. Fill it in purple clay. I thought that looked kind of cool. Someone said I should clear out all the blocks underneath it. Take it all out. And put black glass in. That would look cool too. But I haven't decided what one I want to do. Then I thought about putting like slabs. Up, uh, like bottom slabs. You'd still be able to get up on here and everything. But then I was like, eh, it might look weird because it's going to be all bumpy. Then, well, you know, what I was thinking was I totally screwed up and I should have left this as the bottom floor right here. So then this one have been a problem, but we're going to work around it. Another suggestion I got was cover it with carpet. But I'm going to, what I think I'm going to do off camera, I'm going to come back and I'll show you guys, is I'm going to try some purple stained clay, or the darker purple, What I don't know what color it is, but the darker purple, some purple stained clay, and then I'm going to try some glass on the other side. So they are like right next to each other. So like half, like not even half, like maybe like, Four rows, one, two, three, yeah, like four or five rows will get done on each side. So you can get a look. This is going to get torn out and moved. This doesn't need to be here anymore. Um, and then we got to figure out, well, I'm going to fix the ceiling. So it's flat. And I may actually go through and change it all soon as done. I'm leaving as particular as I can be about this, like, so I'm still moving stuff, so I don't have everything in my inventory. Fix the ceiling. Fix that top row, put some flooring in, take this beacon out, and we will go from there. And we'll, I'm going to look at both, try to decide what I like more, and then go from there. Sorry, I'm just hopping around and talking. I, uh, It's a bad habit. So that that's going to be it for this section. Uh, I'll be back in a second for you guys. Hey guys, um, here we are, back again. To show you guys kind of what I did, I took out... The beacon, I know I said I was going to show you this glass floor, but I really did fall in love with this purple. Um, it's not quite like the same purple in there. It's similar, not a lot. It doesn't actually do pull it out, but I think the purple floor is what I'm going to go with. I still need to go under there and put purple in. I fixed up, that was the wrong button, the things so they're all staggered again. But the thing is, I don't like how it's all stone. It's really throwing me off. I don't like it. So I'm thinking about doing is changing this to spruce as you can see what I've done over here um logs and slabs or full blocks not sure yet I changed all the walls to smooth stone I haven't changed the ceiling yet I'm gonna go through and change the ceiling to smooth stone but I'm also thinking there needs to be this these lights aren't gonna stay I do not like torch fan as I'm placing more torches because of how dark it is so what I'm thinking is some sort of dropped light uh, coming from the ceiling, maybe something coming off the walls, uh, that's kind of something still. Um, then I'm gonna label the rest of these chests, I think like up to here, yeah. This is all for smooth stone. So most of those aren't full. This is the most impressive thing I think I have, this is all full. Full chest, they're full. I need to go through and watch in a bunch more of this. <laughs> But, uh, yeah, that, that's all I got so far done. Uh, we'll be back in a minute with, hopefully, not hopefully, I know we'll get it, <laughs> with a new design for this stair step section covered on the ceiling. Let me get some more of these chests done. Back in a moment. Okay, we're back. Um, I couldn't think of a good lighting thing that I like the most doing. So, as of right now, there are lights behind there, um, because I thought it looked strange without it, considering that wall has all the lights. And then I put the heads on the wall down here, and I really liked the heads on the wall, but I didn't like having um, the stone. It felt like they were just kind of put there. Uh, my plan is that when we, if we get heads turned back on, is to get one of everyone's head and line the wall. Um... So right now there's just torches. Hopefully that will be enough light to light the rest of the room. I'm not sure what to do about these dark spots in the middle of the room. Any ideas, I'll take them in the comments. So this is the end, really the 
end design of my little space. Um, I'm not going to put the bed down here for the reason that it is okay where it is. I still need to do something in here, dress it up a little bit. Um, maybe in here because there's a whole lot of nothing. Other than that, uh, I don't really have anything for this episode. So that's it for today, guys. This is probably shorter than my other videos, just considering I did a lot of off-camera work. Um, th this was done over a span of several days this week uh, with school and work. Um, I have a feeling this is going to be how more and more videos are going to be done. I did it over a span of like four days. And with that, it for me, it makes it more of a challenge to get my videos done in a timely manner. I guess maybe if I work on them before the week of, we'd be doing better off. So the next episode, we are going to work on that boathouse. Let's say, oh, we sit in there, but then I was like, wait, there's gonna be a uh, We're working on the boathouse. Uh, I've got kind of an idea in mind um, and how I want it to be. Um, it's gonna, it might be bigger than this. Uh, I'm not sure yet. But I, I've got a, a slight idea. I may have to go uh, creative world, work on it a little bit just to get some of my ideas out, or then we're going to go from there. Uh, and I think my next plan after that, so here, here's going to be the game plan for, for both the videos, hopefully they'll go according to plan, is boathouse, then tennis courts, and garage. And then I still need to, and in between those, I'm going to place the horse stable front gate and the pool on this side. Get those built up. And then the, then the mansion. Uh, oh, wait, no, no, no. Boathouse, tennis courts, garage, main garden. Yeah, the garden's gotta get built before the other side, so I know how wide to make everything. Then I need to lay out the mansion some. So there might be stuff up here that just kind of pops up. Uh, that wasn't here before, wasn't, you know... Was it necessarily something that is important when you see it, but it'll be important later? It just makes it easier. I need to remove that. Let me put this in there. Um, I could just was I could have still touched up. Whatever. Um. I need the garden so I know the size. Things are going to pop up up here that aren't as important as the stuff that I'm working on. Uh, I may mention them, may not. Uh, but it, it's going to be a work in progress. This is going to be a decent sized build. I still have to think of like a road design that goes in the middle because there's a road on the map that goes straight through everything. It connects it all. It's like a giant driveway. Um, the portal is probably going to get moved. Hopefully. I, I, I'm not going to move it. It's going to be moved to the front gate, which will be over here somewhere. As the front gate, actually. Like, I think that I designed. That's weird. Why are you moving? I don't have a shader pack on. Six foot nine compass. Yeah, because this is. Oh, we're on one ten. I wonder. I don't know. I don't know. It's moving. It must be wind. I don't know. Okay. Well. Short grass, you move. That moves. Flowers move. Flowers.
Star Wars Remains Stationary. Okay, the more you know. Anyway, that's it for today's episode, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. Hope you guys uh, enjoy. I'll talk to you next week. Goodbye.